Hello everyone, my name is John Dole, and we're going to do another Ghost Layers report right here in Tokyo, Japan. Something kind of inter interesting has happened. A former civil servant, uh, Mr. To Tonikao Chindo, I believe I got his name right, has filed a civil lawsuit against the government of Japan for Shinzo Abe's reinterpretation of the Constitution allowing for collective defense. Now, as you know, Article 9 of the Japanese Constitution effectively bars Japan from engaging in war. Now, Shinzo Abe could not get a complete constitutional change to Article 9, so he said instead he did a reinterpretation. Now, of course, this is illegal under Japanese constitutional law, but the bourgeois here in Japan are not going to question that because they want the power of war so bad. And one citizen has stood up and filed a civil lawsuit. Now, unfortunately, I don't see this really going much of anywhere. The reason for the reason why I don't see this going much of anywhere is given a history of this type of action from filing suit against the government or filing suit against corporations who are obviously guilty of sin of doing something illegal. Back when we look back at the anti-nuclear movement, which is still ongoing these days, but they have their problems. They were filing massive civil lawsuits, one after another, one after another, for a multitude of reasons. And almost every one of those cases were shot down by the courts. In the rare cases where the court did agree, the court would fall short of giving any type of recommendation to the government or any corporation. The reason for doing that is because if they do that, well, that creates a change. It creates a change in the power structure, and the bourgeoisie in Japan just cannot let that happen. And like I said, most of the, the nuclear suits, except for a few that are currently pending, have been shot down. And even, like I said, even when the courts do agree that something, some wrong has happened, as in when the last national election, which brought Shinzo Abe into power, several high courts in Japan deemed that election totally fraudulent and unconstitutional. The government did jack about it, because they don't have to, because they have the power to shoot all this down and stop any of it. So it's always a unique tactic to go run to the courts, to try to stop the bourgeois from doing something against the people's interest. But here in Japan, like I said, then given the nature and history of things, when people do run to the courts, I just do not see this man having much success going to the courts because like I said the courts are not on the side of the people here clearly they shoot down any efforts for so-called legal justice and when something is clearly wrong the courts will not recommend the government do anything about it because in some cases the courts won't have the power to and in other cases the courts will not because they need to protect themselves, sorry car, <laughs> protect themselves in their own position and power. So while it is a nice gesture to run to the courts and fight the bourgeois through the courts, it ultimately is going to fail because guess what? The bourgeois own the damn court system. So I did want to make this video real quick, put this out there, say there is continuing efforts but I don't see the courts doing much about it. If this is the first time you see me, hey, subscribe, subscribe. It's right here somewhere. You get lots of videos like this, and sometimes it's a little surprise. So until next time, this is me, John Doe, in Tokyo. Checking out.